Hello, fifth grade. Today we are learning about op art tubes. So we are in our line unit and I thought that this was a cool project to show you how you can use just lines to create um, optical illusion art, which is sort of like when you look at it, it kind of looks like it's three dimensional or sort of pops off the paper. So we've got an instruction page here, and then we're gonna actually make one and practice on the second page of your packet. So today, what you need is your packet and something to draw with. It could be a pencil, pen. I'm gonna use a thin black marker. And then if you have something to color with, then we will add some color when we're finished drawing. Okay. I have our packet here and it starts at the top by saying op art tubes and tells you what it is. It's a style of abstract art that creates optical illusions with lines, shapes, and forms. So then we're going to have step-by-step -step directions on how to make them. So we're going to do a little bit of flipping back and forth between our packet. So it says, number one, start with four wavy vertical lines. And I want you to remember that vertical means up and down. So on the exercise page, we need to, first we need to write our name. And then it said four vertical wavy lines. So we have our box here that we're gonna draw in. And I'm gonna do my four wavy lines. I'm gonna cut myself short there. And we'll have some skinny and some big in my case here. Two, divide your paper in the middle. So we're gonna do a horizontal wavy line, just one through the middle. Okay, number three, add upward curved lines above the middle line and downward curved lines below. So in any given section, so I'll start in this one, I'm going to go the span of my vertical lines with a curved line and it's going to curve upward above that line that we drew. So sort of like rainbow shaped lines all the way up. So we're always going from one vertical line to another. It's always touching from this side to this side. And then it said below, we do downward curved lines like this. So like a bowl shape instead of a rainbow shape. And same rules apply, always from one of our vertical lines to the other. Okay, I'm gonna speed this up and continue that until the whole page is filled. Okay, so after we have filled in the page with curved lines, it says choose a color scheme, create 3D value by pressing harder near the edges and softer in the middle of each section. So I'm gonna get out either crayons or colored pencils and I have um, twistable crayons that I'm gonna use right now. So it says in each um, curve to push harder near the outside and softer towards the middle. So you're literally making your colors go from dark to light to dark again. So what I'm gonna do is do a pattern for each tube and color dark to light to dark again. So in this pattern, I could do purple and blue. And then I would just color every tube and I think I would pick a new pattern or alternate patterns until my page was full of color.
when you have completed your um, op art tubes, and I didn't finish coloring, although I will, um, you're gonna make sure that your name is on it. You're gonna put your packet in your book bag and you're gonna make sure and turn that in the next time you see me.